Today's NW2 video, we're going to be talking about every single soul rifle that got a buff on the Season 5 Reload. We're going to be giving you guys the buff that these weapons got, and we're also going to be showing you guys the best class setup for each one of these assault rifles. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, and this video was very helpful, if y'all could do me a big favor, drop a like on this video, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. And if you guys are on TikTok, make sure you guys follow the page and hit the notification bell, you guys, so you guys stay up to today's video. First things first, first things first, we're going to start with the Camara. This is Warzone only, so it got a close damage increase, far damage increase, head damage multiply increase, and lower torso damage multiply increase. The attachment we're going to be running is the mini right that right here. You're going to go negative 3.00 and negative 2.25 we're going to be running the 10 phoenix right here you're going to go plus 0.48 and then negative 0.40 and then we're going to be using the polar fire s muzzle right here you're going to go negative 1.35 and negative 0.90 uh we're also going to be running the vx pineapple on the barrel you guys right here you're going to go uh, plus 0.80 and negative 0.36 uh, and with this, we're going to be running 45 round mag. So another assault rifle that got above is the FR Avancer. Now this one got a close damage increase and a far damage increase. Now the attachment we're going to be running in here is the Aim Up V4 Optic. Now this right here, you're going to go negative 3.00 and negative 1.38. We're going to be using the long bore attachment and going to go plus 0.50 and negative 0.40. The equal less 80 muzzle, and then you're gonna go uh, negative 1.40 and negative 1.00, and then we're gonna be running the FTA Reaper 56. Now, right here is tricky, you guys. You're gonna go negative 0.80 and negative 0.40, all aimed down the side, and then 45 rounds on this weapon. Now we got the Lashma 556. This one got a head damage multiply increase, neck damage multiply increase, and an upper torso damage multiply increase. And then right here, we're going to be running the S9 Factory. And right here, you're going to go plus 2.40 and negative 4.00. And then we're going to run in the Chronic Mini Dot. This is one of my favorite sites right here. You're going to go negative 3.00 and negative 2.25. Now, also for the barrel, we are going to be running the 15.9 barrel. Now, this is one of the best barrel for this weapon. You're going to go plus 0 0.50 and negative 0 0.40. This is like, it makes it the weapon even better. Now, this is by far my best setup for this weapon. And then you're going to go with the D20 muzzle, you guys. Right here, you're going to go negative 1.40 and plus 1.00. And then we're going to be putting the 40 round on this. Now, the M13B got pretty much all location damage, multiply, increase, neck, chest, pretty much everything. So we're going to be running the same attachment right here. You're going to go negative 3.00, negative 1.65. So we're going to use the 14-inch barrel right here. You're going to go plus 0 0.44 and negative 0 0.40. You're going to use the Ecoline GSX. You're going to go plus 1.40 and plus 0.81. And then we're going to use my favorite right here, the FTAC Tiger Grip. This one's going to give you aim and stability and recoil control. This is by far one of my favorite uh, grips. And then you're going to go plus 0.80 and plus 0.40. And then we're going to put this 60 round mag. The M13C got a close damage increase, mid damage increase, and all location damage multiply increase. We're going to be running the Aim Up V4. You're going to go negative 2.81 and negative 1.54. Right here, the VOK. This is my favorite laser right here. You're going to go negative 0.50 and negative 51. And then right here, you're going to use a 14 inch uh, barrel and you're going to go plus 0 0.50 and negative 0 0.40 we're going to be using the rf crown this right here gives you a lot of recoil plus 0 0.80 and plus 0 0.31 pretty much help you with the recoil that's what i mean and then we're going to run the 60 round mac and then we're going to be talking about the m4a1 you got and then my favorite assault rifle on all call of duty games the m4a1 now we're going to be running the aim up v4 optic now you don't have to run this optic every single time you guys you can switch it up and right here, we're going to go plus 1.00 and aim down the side. We're going to go negative 3.00. And then we're going to be using the 20 inch right here. You're going to go plus 0 0.50 and plus 0 0.35. Um, the nine mono right here, you're going to go plus 1.40. And then at the bottom, you can either go bullet velocity or uh, instability. I want instability, negative 0.76. The FTA 6 uh, Reaper. 
uh, this one right here you're gonna go plus 0 0.80 and plus 0 0.40 and we're gonna run 40 round mag and then we got the STB assault rifle this is the Korean cyber setup right here you guys so pretty much this one all he had was a head damage multiply increase and if you guys can just copy these attachments right here uh, this right here we're gonna go plus 2.52 and negative 1.74 um and then we got the Bruin 686 you're gonna go plus 0 0.50 and plus 0 0.25 the FTAC Reaper 56 right here you're gonna go plus 0 0.70 and plus 0 0.34 and then 44 42 round mag on this one but anyway man that's it for all the class setup you guys and all the buff for all so rifle anyway thank you guys for watching drop a like follow the page let's get it